I think one of the bigger, the biggest difference is that like it allows us to tackle more complex problem, and which are the problems we face today. You know, I mean, the easy problem has all been solved, uh, as one of my professors told me. Um, and these challenging problems now are, you know, beyond one person's ability, and they need collaborations of many people. And very often, I think these uh, collaboration tools allows us to identify um, skill sets or knowledge that are in people that were not explicitly declared, right? I mean, I may tell you that, I'm, I mean, I am a uh, uh, analy analytics um, person. I'm a data analyst. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm a data scientist. I have backgrounds in so forth, so on and so forth. But I can't tell you everything that I know, right? I mean, do you, I may be, uh, maybe I, I know a particular uh, knowledge, you know, I, I know, like, for example, I know uh, neuroscience and, and very few people in the uh, social industry knows about this because my PhD is actually in neuroscience. And maybe in some areas that require some knowledge of how the human brain works, right? And if I don't explicitly declare that, sometimes it's, it's very hard for people to find out that I, 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 have, a, I have that skill. Right, mm. but by making the problem visible to me, I say, "Oh, okay, that's an obvious problem." You know, I, I know how to solve that. You no, know? because I know what I know. Right, other people don't know what I know. But making the problem explicit and visible to everybody, you know, you have many more pairs of eyes to look at the problem, and they could, and giving everybody a chance to say that you know uh, whether this is something that I can do or I cannot do. So you, you essentially tackle a bigger problem, and you find the skill necessary to tackle those problems faster and easier. I think that's one of the big, big difference.